Well, the countdown is on for the 66th running of the Daytona 500, also known as the Great American Race. This weekend kicks off the 2024 season of the NASCAR's top three series. Reporter Kevin Connolly has our story. Oh yes, the Harley J. Earl Trophy. It's huge, weighing over 100 pounds and four feet tall. It doesn't leave the speedway and will be rolled out to victory lane on Sunday. However, the trophy that the winner lifts over their head, they get to take home a replica, and that weighs 54 pounds. It's the trophy every driver wants. Everybody knows the rules, you can't touch it. Right, everybody knows what it looks like. I don't even got to look at it to just draw it to you in my head. Uh, yesterday was probably the first day that I've ever thought about how heavy it would be. I was looking at pictures of like the last 10 winners or whatever and seeing what guys needed help lifting it up and what guys could do it by themselves. Uh, you can daydream about winning all, all you want, but you have to understand how you're going to do it first. One driver who knows what it's like to hoist that trophy is Michael McDowell. He shocked the NASCAR world in 2021 by winning this event. McDowell still remembers that celebration in Victory Lane. Well, most of it. I don't remember much of that moment. There's like a 10 or 15 minute gap that I don't have. Like I just lost it, like it's not there. So the question is who will be holding the trophy on Sunday evening? And the thing about Daytona, which is different from other tracks where 10 to 12 guys have a chance to win, there are about 30 guys that have a legitimate chance at winning the Great American Race. Reporting in Daytona, I'm Kevin Conley.